Hi, I'm Rob Chavez from Intel Corporation. I'm excited to bring to you today our next generation smart factory, bringing together technologies from Intel, Schneider Electric, and Red Hat. Today we're going to have a walkthrough of these technologies from Jeremy Olette. So what we have behind me is a simulated environment with a water tank here simulating oil and gas industry. We're maintaining the top water tank level with a PLC. In a typical environment, you would have a hardware PLC. What we're going to do is show how that's been migrated to a software PLC and how you can achieve high availability of a software PLC in a software process automation environment. What we have here are what we call distributed control nodes, DCNs for short, a server running Ansible controller, and we're going to be deploying that software PLC as a container workload onto these DCNs. I will now introduce the software failure by actually disconnecting one of these DCNs. And what we'll see is how the remaining workload becomes single. There's only one instance now. Ansible controller will detect that there's only one instance and deploy another. And when it does so, it'll reestablish communication and enter high availability mode and will be fully redundant. Thanks, Jeremy. It's been a great collaboration working with Schneider Electric, working with Red Hat to really bring kind of the weight and the influence and the maturity they have in the, in the market to realize this software-defined industrial control system. We've got Schneider Electric providing the control infrastructure, Red Hat providing the management infrastructure, and it's been a fantastic collaboration. Thank you, Rob. Indeed, it was a great collaboration that started about a year ago with Intel with the reference architecture and now adding lately the Red Hat for all the orchestration that we can bring. We're defining the future of what automation will be. Thanks, Andre. Yeah, Red Hat is very excited to be a part of this collaboration. Uh, we're providing kind of that edge-ready infrastructure and edge-ready automation and orchestration that are going to power the next generation of distributed control systems that are going to run power plants and oil refineries and all the manufacturing lines that ultimately make the things that we consume and use and drive and, and work with every single day. Gentlemen, let's bring it in. That is too cheesy. <laughs> Thank you.